Rethinking the Universe, Cracks in the Cosmic Clock, Just a Hundred Years Ago, Humanity's Understanding of the Cosmos was Astonishingly Narrow. Most astronomers believed that everything that existed, the entire universe, was contained within a single galaxy, the Milky Way. The notion that there could be countless galaxies beyond our own was almost unimaginable. But in 1928, that idea was shattered. Through years of careful observation, Edwin Hubble discovered something revolutionary. The universe is expanding. Galaxies are not fixed in space. They are moving away from each other, driven by an unknown force. This changed everything. It redefined our sense of place in the cosmos and sparked the beginning of modern astronomy. Fast forward several decades and the Hubble Space Telescope extended that discovery even further. In 1997, it revealed something even more astonishing. The expansion of the universe wasn't slowing down, it was accelerating. A mysterious and invisible force seemed to be driving this acceleration. Today, we call it dark energy. This invisible force altered how we measure the universe's age, which was recalculated to be approximately 13.8 billion years. But that estimate may now be under serious question. The James Webb Space Telescope changes the game Enter the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, the most powerful observatory ever launched. Its advanced capabilities are revealing new cosmic mysteries that are challenging long-accepted theories about the origin and age of the universe. One key clue lies within a dense star cluster inside our own galaxy called M92. This ancient collection of stars is one of the oldest known formations in the Milky Way. Estimates suggest that it may be 13.8 billion years old, perhaps even older. But that doesn't make sense. If the universe itself is 13.8 billion years old, then no object inside it can be older. Stars are supposed to form after the universe begins, not before it. And yet, M92 appears to contradict that logic entirely. To determine its age more precisely, astronomers ran simulations using over 20,000 synthetic star models. The outcome was astonishing. The cluster's age closely matched the universe's own supposed beginning. This raised a profound question. Have we been wrong about the age of the universe all along? Ancient galaxies that shouldn't exist the James Webb Telescope didn't stop there. It looked farther into space, and deeper into the past, than ever before. It detected galaxies that existed only 300 million years after the Big Bang. But here's the problem. Those galaxies appeared too massive and too complex to have formed so early in the universe's history. Current models say it takes billions of years to form such large structures. So how did they appear so quickly? Some scientists are now proposing a bold new theory. What if the universe isn't 13.8 billion years old? What if it's actually 26.7 billion years old? This radical new estimate comes from theories suggesting that our understanding of cosmic expansion, star formation, and galaxy development may be deeply flawed. The Methuselah Star. A paradox in the sky Another puzzle adding to the mystery is a star known as the Methuselah Star, or HD 140283. Based on its properties, it appears to be 14.5 billion years old, nearly a billion years older than the universe itself, according to standard models. This isn't just a curious observation, it's a direct challenge to the timeline of the cosmos. By all known physics, stars cannot exist before the universe begins. Yet this star continues to shine, defying everything we know about stellar life cycles. It raises a difficult question. Could our entire understanding of time in the universe be incorrect? The Hubble tension. Cracks in the expansion rate at the center of our understanding of cosmic history is a number called the Hubble constant. It measures how fast the universe is expanding. But there's a serious problem. When astronomers measure the early universe, using the cosmic microwave background, they get one value. When they measure the local universe, using nearby galaxies and stars, they get another. The two results don't match. This disagreement is called the Hubble tension. And it's not just a calculation error. It could point to a fundamental gap in our physics. Some theorists believe that dark energy, once thought to be constant, may actually be changing over time. 
If true, this would dramatically affect how we estimate cosmic distances and ages, and possibly resolve the tension between the two measurements. Rethinking the beginning. Is the universe cyclical? All of these mysteries lead to an even more radical idea. What if the universe didn't begin with a single Big Bang, but instead goes through endless cycles of expansion and contraction? This theory, known as the cyclic universe, proposes that the cosmos has no real beginning or end. Instead, it experiences repeating phases of creation and destruction, Big Bangs followed by Big Crunches. If this is true, the ancient galaxies seen by JWST may be remnants from a previous cycle, not the result of one singular origin. Primordial black holes and the multiverse Some researchers believe that mysterious primordial black holes, formed shortly after the earliest moments of the universe, could have acted as seeds for galaxies. These black holes may have helped galaxies grow much faster than current models allow. If that's the case, it might explain the appearance of fully formed galaxies just 300 million years after the supposed beginning of time. But then comes an even more mind-bending idea, the possibility of a multiverse. What if our universe is just one of many, each with its own physics, timelines, and galaxies? If multiple universes exist, some of the strange structures we're seeing could be evidence of other universes bleeding into ours. A cosmic overlap that Webb may be detecting for the first time. Time, quantum physics, and the edge of understanding in the realm of quantum physics, time itself behaves strangely. In extreme environments, such as near black holes, time stretches and slows. In the early moments of the universe, quantum fluctuations may have altered the flow of time entirely. Some physicists even suggest that time didn't exist in the way we understand it. It may have flickered in and out, warped and twisted, before stabilizing into the timeline we now experience. The story is just beginning with every new image and measurement. The James Webb Space Telescope is rewriting our understanding of reality. It's revealing a universe that may be older, more complex, and more mysterious than we ever imagined. What if the Big Bang wasn't the beginning? What if the universe is 26.7 billion years old, or even eternally cycling? What if our universe is just one thread in a vast cosmic fabric, and we are only now beginning to unravel its story? One thing is clear. Webb is not just a telescope. It is a time machine. A storyteller. A portal into questions far bigger than we've ever dared to ask. And as we stand on the edge of discovery, we must continue to look deeper, think wider, and keep questioning everything we think we know. Because in doing so, we might finally understand the universe, and our place within it.